Hey, it's your sister Michelle here again. Yep, how are you doing? Hadn't seen you in a minute. Come on in to the slumber party. Hope you're doing good on your journey. I love you so, so much. Thank you for growing my channel. New subscribers, new subscribers coming in. I love you. Old subscribers, you know you're my family. I love you all so, so much. We're going to get together. You know how we do. Slumber party. Yes, come on in. Let's talk about these one-eyed roaches. Yeah, let's talk about them. Yes, no wing having water bugs. That's what they are. And I ain't changed my mind yet. <laughs> I love y'all so much, and I hope you're doing well. And if you're not, I always tell you, it will get better. I promise you, just give it time. I know it doesn't seem like it, but listen to your sister. I know what I'm talking about. It don't last forever. It just feels like it, okay? Yes, let's talk about the narcissist. And do they get better with age? Someone asked me that. They were like, well, does, do narcissists get better the older they get? The answer is no. No, the answer is not just no. The answer is hell no. <laughs> no, they don't get better with age. They get worse. I think I said in my other videos before, they learn more and more how to, to adapt to people because they learn from all the things they've done to other people before you. And you know what I mean? So they learn how to manipulate better, lie better, scheme better, cheat better. If you, you know, if you want to call it better, I don't call it better. Nothing they do to me is better, but you understand the concept, right? They don't get better with age. No. They tend to get worse and worse and worse. With every individual, every situation is always a worse situation. Okay? Now, let me give you a story time. You know, I always try to give you story time. The ex I was with. He's old as dirt now. No, I'm <laughs> just joking. He's older now. Okay? We're in our 50 range. You know what I'm saying? He's like 50. Um, He's worse than when he was when I first met him. I met him when he was 30-something. And he was bad then. But he's super bad now. Okay. Because he used to be manipulative in the beginning. He lied in the beginning. But now I've noticed that his lying is at a different peak. He don't just lie about certain things. He lies about almost everything. He hasn't improved his situation one bit. It's gotten worse. The new supply that he's with now, his character and everything is 10 times worse than what it was when I first met him. And that, that should say a lot because he was pretty bad off even though I didn't really know it. But when I just started realizing what I was dealing with, I realized he was, you know, lying and all that. Um, he was already in a bad situation. But now that he's with the new supply, his character is even worse than that. Which is hard to believe, but they always go to the bottom. And that's where they come from. But they don't get better with age. No, they get worse. Yeah, they get worse. Because the truth of the matter is, when they're going through this situation in their mind, and all the sickness that dwells in them, and all that emptiness, that hole that never gets filled, believe it or not, that hole that don't get filled, it gets wider and wider and wider. Right? Just like something like a trash bag. If you put trash in a bag and you keep putting it in, what does it do? It expands out. It gets bigger and bigger and bigger. It starts overflowing, right? It doesn't get better the more trash you put in it, right? It doesn't, the more trash you put in it, it, the trash don't get smaller, now does it? That bag don't, don't shrink smaller. It gets larger and larger and larger with all the trash and gunk, right, that you put in it, okay? Same thing with the narcissist. All the gook and trash and all the shit they put out in the world and all that emptiness they have, it gets worse. It builds up. It goes. It overflows. The older they get, the more that's in there, the more that they've done, the more dirt, the bigger and bigger the situation becomes. It's, it becomes even more, even though you don't give them no credit, and they don't deserve it. It becomes so more overwhelming for them. You would think if, over time that they would learn from their mistakes and say, okay, well, maybe I need to do this, which they don't learn. You know that. But you would think they would learn and say, okay, well, I need to do this different now. Because this didn't work the last 15,000 times. So let me try 15,001 and maybe I can do it different. No. No, let's see. Sister. No learning ass illiterate fuckers. And I said it. YouTube better not block me. They never learn. So that hole and stuff, like I said, it gets bigger and bigger. The older they get, the bigger the trash is, right? So what happens is they end up saying to themselves, even though they don't let us know. Damn, everything that I've tried, I failed at. Every person I tried to break that I wasn't successful at breaking. And even the ones that I did break. Still, didn't, even the ones they do break, still don't give them peace. And that's the thing. Let's talk about that. They go, they make an effort to really break us or try to. Because you know they don't never get all of us. Try to break us, right? And even the people that are successful at completely breaking or seeing broken, like mine saw me in a situation where I was down at the bottom. You would think that would give them some kind of fulfillment. Like, okay, my job is done. I finally done this. No. Even that isn't enough. This, the main thing they're trying to do to you by destroying you still isn't enough for them. Isn't that crazy? Like, okay, I'm going to sit here and just mistreat this individual until so they can't take it no more. Can't take it no more. That's my goal. My goal is to just destroy them because I never wanted them from the beginning. 
destroy them totally, break them down to the bottom underneath me because I don't feel like shit myself. And when I get to that, oh, I'm going to feel some kind of relief from it. They don't. Ain't that crazy? They don't feel any kind of relief from it. It makes it even worse for the next person. It's like a parasite. The more blood they get, right, the more they want. It's like, okay, I succeeded at trying to hurt this person. Now, that wasn't enough. I seen I done that. It, it fulfilled me for a second. Now, I still feel bad about myself. I'm still empty. I still don't feel like I'm worth anything. So let me go on to the next person that don't know, but unbeknownst to them, and do the same thing to them. But this time, I'm going to be worse because maybe if I, the worst of treatment I put out this time, maybe when I finally do do them this way, I real feel good. I'll feel good now. I'm, or I don't mistreat this person even worse than the last one. Now, I'm going to really finally get to a point where I feel like I'm better than someone else. But that never happens because deep inside, they know they're never better than anyone else. That's the problem within itself. Now, listen to your sister. And they don't get better with age. They get more ugly and more stanking. Now that's what they get with age. I told you before, people tend to look like how they act. And you know, you can look at most of them. They look half dead. Depleted. Bombed out. Bombed away. All the good stuff I'll be saying. <laughs> but at the end of the day, listen to your sister. If you're thinking, like I said, when they're with a the new supply. Or you know, you've seen them doing this for years. And they're aging and they're getting older like we all are. And they're going to get better with time. No, it's worse, baby. That's why a lot of times when we get discarded. And you know... And we get out of the situation. We're lucky in a way. Even, well, we're lucky to get away from them anyway. Because they don't deserve us. But we're really lucky because the next person they went as they age gets the worst treatment. The worst treatment. The worst treatment. It gets worse and worse. I've heard of narcissists who have went to the grave hurting people. And you know what's so messed up about it? They'll be in the grave. And still people will be hurting behind the shit they done to them. Ain't that some shit? That's why we have to heal completely. Don't give them that kind of satisfaction. Work on ourselves so we don't have to, you know, that gunk in our life. And if, you know, something does happen to them, we won't be sitting around holding grudges and stuff like that. And they still have control of us with one foot in the grave or two feet in the damn grave or whatever. You know what I'm saying? They look dead. Like I said, they look dead anyway. They need to grab several coffins, if you ask me. <laughs> they don't get better with age, baby. But we can get better with age. Okay? That's what this is all about anyway. You're strong, beautiful, phenomenal, wonderful. I love you all so much. And I know that you all can make this through each part of your journey. And once again, thank you all for growing my channel. And I love each and every one of you so much. Take care. Bye.